Good evening, gentlemen. Yarg. Oh, good evening. Good I'm evening. Right. Before <laughs> we begin, if I can find out where I just put it, because I dragged it somewhere and I wanted to... God damn it. I had this thing and I really wanted to share it. I had this big thing all set up, ready to go. I, had, and... I, I dragged the tap and of course now it's just gone. Um... Oh god! Oh damn! Should we, should we restart the stream just to? No, uh, no, no. See it's, if it it's, comes it's back. story time. Oh, it's, story it's time! It's Twitter story time. Oh. Twitter, you say? What is this Twitter you this speak Twitter, of? This Twitter, this Twitter, right? So, ladies and gentlemen, and NBPs, um, hi. So. Mr. Erfart works for a well-known video game publisher um, in his other life. And his boss in his boss's other life um, oh. messes about messes about with, um, with with horses and medieval regalia and all sorts of things, okay? I would like to refer you to this tweet from Jason Kingsley, CBE, <laughs> from, from 9.43 a.m. today. Oh, no. Content warning. Not rude, but on a subject some may find unpleasant over Sunday breakfast. One of my stallions, Talos, got out and into the brood mare paddock somehow. So I may have one or more unexpected falls in 11 months time. That's not the tale. He got kicked. He got, sorry, he got badly kicked in his penis. <laughs> and it swelled up nastily. I've spent this morning with a cold hose on his bits. <laughs> trying to reduce the inflammation. And the vet is on the way to help. Hosing a stallion's doodah on a Sunday morning after an aurora was not on my bucket list. <laughs> I do have pictures that were sent to the vet earlier, but I'm not going to share them here. <laughs> so if this happens after an aurora, does this mean that the stallion was possessed by Loki? Quite possibly. Or would have been the mayor. Second... Second... <laughs> Second, I was going to say, did uh, you find the one two hours ago? So, Sega, second tweet from 6.21pm. Update on the stallion's middle wicket. <laughs> the 30 minute cold water hosing every hour has helped. But the vet thought he'd better get to the horse clinic where they could look after him and use drugs if needed. <laughs> He doesn't look to be in pain. He'll be getting cold water and figgy massages around the clock. Hopefully he'll be well in 48 hours of intensive handling. I'm both very worried, exhausted, and find it awfully funny. In response... In, resp <laughs> in response to a query... From somebody else on Twitter saying, Poor Talos, he dreamed of the fame of the h horse Casanova, but somehow it didn't work out. Jason responds, He'll be fine once it's dealt with and back to form, with no lessons learned at all, I'll bet. <laughs> <laughs> but, yes. I'm letting, I'm letting, making sure that, that Earthheart knew all of this story, so when he's in work on Monday... <laughs> He's just aware that this is a thing that has happened and he should avoid anything, any comments about swelling or <laughs> swelling or dicking around or anything <laughs> along those lines. Don't mention horses, don't mention vets. Um, yeah, that was a thing that happened apparently. I don't know. I think Jason takes that all in good stride, actually. Oh yes, so. I, I think that. I think the idea is now you're trying to weave in but, as much as that as possible yes. without overtly saying it. So did Temple you have? Meeting, I mean. So did you have a swell weekend? Um, no. Yeah, or, 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 or rather, I I didn't, but somebody else did. But yes, poor Talos the horse got his rocks off. Possibly, <laughs> nay, mention it. No, no, Nepal, no. 
But yes, he got his rocks off and then got kicked in the penis. By a horse, no less. Goodness By a me. Mare, I'd assume. By a, well, I would assume. Oh, if he's done it himself, that's very impressive <laughs> for a horse. That's very, so, that's very impressive of a horse, both for dexterity and the, the possibilities <laughs> of how that's, po- that's physically possible. So would you say that you, would, that you would call this the Talos Principle, then? I would most definitely call it the Talos Principle. Try and solve that puzzle. I hate you all. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Indeed. We, we shouldn't be dicks about it. There's... Um, uh, okay, so that was that. That was that glorious... <laughs> glorious tale of the head of rebellion's horse and his and his swollen penis that's the horse by the way uh, so anyway we leave that we leave that which will go into a which will go into a scrapbook show at some point in time no doubt 